Do you remember the film The Witch? Yes, it was a good film. Yeah, it was, wasn't it? Do you remember the film The Lighthouse? Yes, it was a good film, wasn't it? Yeah, it was. So do you like the director? I think it's Robert mean? Eggers. Yeah, I do. So how would you characterise him as a filmmaker? He makes offbeat, strange, yeah. atmospheric films that are sometimes low on conventional storytelling. Yeah, that describes him. Would you? Would yep. you say that? I'd say that. Okay, well, this is a new film called The Northman. It's the been North much, Man. much heralded. It's about Vikings. Is it black and white? It's got a scar guard in it. Oh, a scar guard. One of the scar guards. Apparently, like there are of... hundreds of them. Yeah, thousands. Well, there's at least seven. Well, there's there? almost an entire Viking tribe of them. <laughs> what do you think of the Vikings? Are you a Viking fan? Oh, for goodness sake. I'm probably part Viking. Do you think? Eight okay, eight. well, this is the Northman starring one of the scar guards, one of the many scar The Northman or the Norseman? The Northman. The North. But the, I would have thought the word Norse is, or North, is a deriv, deriv, derivation of Norse. I would have thought so too. You That's think? why I'm asking for clarification. So the North is in fact the Norse. I would have thought so. So does that mean the horse is the hoof? <laughs> okay, so this is the Northman. You ready? I'm ready. <laughs> wasn't in there exactly. B I want to avenge you father it, it felt a little bit like a snapshot of my childhood oh, I want to avenge you father I want to save you mother I want to avenge you father I want to save you there's a lot going on in there there is it, it was I mistaken or was it sort of hand colored some of it was sort it of did, a, it had a sort of grainy sort of charcoal -y color to the color didn't it but then the background seemed to be like when they yes, used to do hand it's almost like he did a really colourful film and then he did a really black and white film and this is in between this is almost yeah. sort of monochrome -y kind of yeah um what did you think mum um too much going on i have to say i like mm. vikings i like viking warfare i like mm. viking violence mm. i like what the vikings do sometimes i kind of do wouldn't you? mind being a viking but, rape and pillage well no i don't like that side of it no. obviously no not at all 
But um, Anya Taylor-Joy obviously connected Always. back to the fact that she was in The Witch. That's where she first came to prominence. Is it really? Yeah, first one. Okay, I've forgotten that. Willem Dafoe in there as a sort of maniac. As a, just a, the weirdest face in the whole of cinema history. Yeah, Ethan Hawke taking a Fabulous. few arrows for the team there. Yeah. Jesus Christ. He's in a lot of things at the He's moment. He's in a lot of things, Mum. Bjork's in there. I didn't see Bjork I in the trailer. I didn't see Bjork either. But I tell you what, I'm a big fan of, of Bjork. But does that mean you want to watch it? Do you think he's gone a bit mainstream there? Well, it's funny that you should say that because the answer's in the question. Do I want to watch it from that trailer? No. Oh. That trailer did not do it for me. Oh. But all and Nicole Kidman, I have to say, is becoming a pet dislike of mine. I, I think, yeah, I'm feeling bad. the same thing. When I see her there, I think I hope she's not in it for too long. Yeah, I'm, that's exactly what I thought. Mm, so yeah. it, providing she isn't, I'd be interested in it for the actors in it the general mise-en-scene but the actual mise-en-scene is the set design it's yeah, a sort of wanky way of describing all, the way it looks yeah you know yeah i thought i thought it, it i thought it was giving me everything that in the end game of thrones wasn't giving me which yeah. was like visceral sweat and the yeah. flesh yeah and sort of just body fluid exactly but in a way i just didn't think the trailer was very well put together oh, right. it was a bit it was a bit all over the place i, I hope anya taylor joy doing all that witchery that, that all got me going and then there's the woman with the strange eyes maybe that was bjork she's always got strange yeah, eyes. yeah scar scarred looking great yeah though. but anya taylor joy's got to do more than that we can all do that <laughs> you can true. do it yeah, more than most for more film and family fun don't forget to click the subscribe button and make sure to click the bell to never miss an update